Every minute a woman is killed by heart disease and today is Go Red for Women designed to reverse the deadly trend and promote healthier lives for women of all ages. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here now with more on a new advance in treating heart disease. Yeah, this is really impressive, guys. You know, 44 million American women are living with heart disease and millions more are at risk and don't know it. Finding and treating it early are critical and there have been a number of advances. One is making heart surgery a whole lot easier on patients. If I'm going out, Nancy Judovitz uses necklaces to cover the scar on her chest following heart surgery in December. I'm really doing pretty well. Nancy had an aortic aneurysm and needed a valve replacement, which traditionally is done with an 18 inch incision to open the chest. But Nancy, an active mom who loves traveling, had a minimally invasive alternative. It requires very special tools and imaging techniques to be able to do that. Cardiothoracic surgeon Dinos Plastis with Mainline Health says the specialized equipment allows him to access the aorta with a four to five inch incision. You can barely see the incision. Dr. Plastis is able to replace a valve exposing just a small portion of the heart. When the incision is smaller, then the pain is less the recovery is much faster. This is a very new development. The heart still has to be temporarily stopped and the patient is on a heart-lung bypass machine for the surgery, but the smaller incision has patients like Nancy recovering in weeks. Modern medicine is great. <laughs> um, less invasive is always better. Um, and the, mo the sooner you can get back to normal living, um, I think the better off you're, you're going to be in the long run. Now, Nancy, like many women, didn't know she had heart disease. She was eventually diagnosed after complaining to her doctor that she felt tired a lot.